Well, they're all oiled. So just point out some of the cool things that I wanted to show. So these knots, nice and solid, look cool. This one had some spaltic in it. Now the other side is perfectly red, but I thought this would be more dynamic to show that. And then up here, I thought this was a really cool piece, how it's kind of got a burl going in, going on with it. And then a couple knots here, kind of thought they should show. So you, as you're putting them down, you kind of pick the part of the wood you'd like to show. And this one, we got this area up here I thought was kind of cool. So the difference in design, notice this one's got the four blocks going on there. This one has the one block with the three blocks down here. So they look very similar, but yet different. I thought that would be cool for them next to each other. We also have some different levels here. So they're not all the same. It's not flat. It gives a little bit more dimension. So those are some of the things I thought were really cool. And I think it's going to look great on the wall next to that other frame. So we got walnut or black walnut. We got the white walnut, the butternut, one and the same. The white ash right here. We got a red oak, another red oak. Notice the differences. Remember, there's different species of red oak and there's different species of white oak. Here's a white oak and there's a butternut. This is a softer wood. This one's a super hard wood. There's some black walnut, but it's towards the outer edge of the log. And we have pretty much the same woods over here, just different ways, different places, and different angles. Okay, I'm going to take a break. These need to dry anyways, give another coat, and then at least dry for another day, maybe two days, before we hang them. Okay, time to take a break. Look awesome, though.